Greetings, scum. This is Lord Frieza with a rather imperative announcement. Subscribe to Super Mecha Frieza, lest I sell this pathetic rock you call a planet for mere pennies. Ho ho ho! Hey guys, so unexpected turn of events, um, the trailer was leaked today. Now I thought it was coming out tomorrow, so I had my schedule all planned out, but I guess, no, no. The trailer came out today, it was leaked, and everyone is going crazy, I think. I don't know. <laughs> today I kind of just woke up and then I saw that the trailer was out and I'm like, oh no, it came out early. I thought I had all of this planned out, but I guess not. Anything can happen, so... Whew, I'm excited to watch it. I'm actually kind of glad it came out a little bit early because waiting another day would have been torture. I just want to know what's going to happen. And I was told about a week ago, basically, or a couple days, I don't know, ago, <laughs> that the trailer will feature a lot of the Saiyans past. I mean, we've seen it on Twitter and stuff. People were talking about it. So the trailer will focus on the past. And we'll get some Frieza as well because he was a big role in the Saints history just because, you know, you know what happens in the end. Frieza goes, boo, ha, ha, ha. Frieza destroys planet Vegeta and you get his laugh like, oh, ho, ho, ho. I don't, that's, <laughs> that's my best Frieza impression. But um, I'm really excited because, you know, more Frieza, of course. Frieza fan right here love Frieza. I'm also interested in learning more about the Saiyans history as well. I mean, we have Goku's history that we really don't know much about. I mean, we know a little bit about Vegeta's history just because of Dragon Ball Z. I mean, we always got those flashbacks and Vegeta talked about it, but Goku, we really don't know much about like his experience. And Goku was really young when he was sent away, so how is he supposed to remember? But, um, also, Broly's history will probably get. So I'm just really excited. And anyways, I'm going to stop blabbering on. And so I've been waiting long enough. Um, I'm ready. I'm pumped. I'm ready to watch the trailer. So let's just get to it. Boo. So the trailer I'm watching has closed captioning. I don't know if it will show up for you guys, but I am at least like going to read them. I don't know if they're 100% accurate though, but I'm just going to read them anyways. It's better than like no dialogue translation at all. So... Here we go, let's get to it. Okay. Like the music already. Oh, look at all the Frieza pods. Oh, I like the black Frieza shit, that's cool. Oh, the Ginyu Force. Oh, oh, oh. What is up with Frieza's style, man? The Saiyans should follow Frieza's orders. Yes, they should. Three Saiyans born. Oh, we're gonna see baby Goku. <laughs> Oh, there's Bardock! Oh, Vegeta! Okay, Vegeta looks so adorable. Look at him! Oh, all the daddies are in here. Oh, man. Oh, look at little Broly! There's not much time. Frieza's plotting something. <laughs> oh, oh! What is up with his color? He's so reddish pink! Uh, okay. <gasps> Kine! Oh my gosh! Oh. Oh. Oh no. That's gonna be so Oh, look at the babies! Oh, there goes Frieza. Yeah. Okay, so they did something weird with this color scheme. Is that supposed to be, like, first form? Aww. Aww. <laughs> okay. Okay. I have a lot of questions, first of all. Frieza's color scheme. It's very red. I'm one is that supposed to be his first form in this movie, or is that supposed to be like like half form? I don't know. First of all, from what we've seen in Dragon Ball Z, Frieza like at least he had the arm pads, but he also had like the white armor covering his body, and this one was just very like pink reddish pink. I don't know how I feel about the warm color scheme on Frieza. It just was a little shocking, to be honest. I'm so used to the first form that we've seen in Dragon Ball Z and in Resurrection F, um, so that was kind of weird, but okay. <laughs> okay, so what I'm seeing, and I haven't really read much into Dragon Ball Minus, but it seems they're following that storyline. They have Gine in there, Gine, 
Guinea. I think it's Guinea. I said Guinea. I meant Guinea. Um, they have Guinea in here. Goku's mom with Bardock. And it was really cool to see Bardock in it too, but, you know. Expected if we're gonna get a past story, of course we're gonna see Bardock. A lot of people like Bardock, so. <laughs> but, um, Guinea was a really cool touch to the trailer because we have not seen her in animated form yet. No, I don't think so. No, we haven't. Um, Gine is Goku's mom in Dragon Ball Minus, and that was so sweet when they were just giving each other, like, a hug or arm around as Goku was being sent off, so that's probably going to be really sad to watch, and I think Herm's translated something about, um, the first 20 to 30 minutes of the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie will make you cry, so be ready. <laughs> it's gonna be sad. I mean, when you see all of those Saiyan kids, like, you can't help but to feel sorry for them. I mean, you know what's gonna happen. We all know what's gonna happen. Planet Vegeta is going to be destroyed by Frieza, so I wonder if they're gonna show, because this was a point made in the series that Beerus orders Frieza to destroy Planet Vegeta, so I'm wondering if we're gonna see that involved in the movie. Because that was something I was always curious about. You would think that they would do that because they gave us that piece of information that we would see that interaction between Frieza and Beerus. Or like Frieza's father and Beerus. I don't know. Um, but we saw Ruthless Frieza. I mean, his dad's like, you must follow Frieza's orders. And we also saw that Frieza soldier that was in the present day trailer. The last trailer. That weird like oval shaped guy. So he'll be in it too. Uh, the Ginyu Force, I don't mind that. I mean, they're a very colorful bunch of people. They're kind of funny, so yay, Ginyu Force, more Ginyu Force. And I like Jace, too. I think he's pretty cool. Um, um, but yeah, so we see little baby Vegeta, and he was so adorable. Like, when you just see the innocence on these kids' faces, it, it does, like, it kind of hurts your heart <laughs> knowing what's going to happen to them. So I can see, I can see, like, where we might cry. I don't know what's going to happen. There's probably going to be a, a really depressing event. I'm assuming it'll be between Gine and Bardock. There might be something really sad happening. I'm, like, trying to predict this sad moment because I don't want to, I don't want my heart to break in theaters, but, whew. Overall, this trailer was good. The music, the art style, Frieza style, I'll take a little bit to get used to, but I don't mind it. It's pretty, it's cool that it's different, um... Although I do like Final Form Frieza the best. So, but it's cool. We get to see more of King Cold too. I mean, when we saw him in the... <laughs> when we saw him get killed by Future Trunks, I mean, he didn't really see much of a king. He seemed kind of pathetic. So, whew, I want to see more of like an evil, badass King Cold. So, hopefully we get that in the movie. I mean, they seem pretty ruthless in the trailer. But dang, I don't know. What do you guys think of it? Are you happy? Are you sad that they're kind of following the minus storyline in this trailer? Oof, like losing my jacket. Um, are you happy or sad they're kind of following the minus storyline in the trailer? Are you excited to see baby Saiyans and how cute they are and their little innocent faces? And, oh, so kawaii. Yeah, what do you guys think overall in the trailer? Please comment down below. I want to hear your thoughts and just what you think about it because this, this is this is a lot of new stuff we're getting in a trailer. It's not just the whole present day fight with Broly. We get the past too. So this is going to be a long movie. I think it was a hundred minutes long. I don't, don't take my word for that. So it'll be a longer than, this anime movie will be a little longer than usual, which is cool because, you know, more content, more stuff to watch. <laughs> I, sometimes anime movies just feel so short. So I'm glad this one will be a little longer and you know, I'm just excited. I'm pumped to see Frieza. I'm pumped to see Goku's past, Vegeta's past, Broly's past. I mean, all of it looks so interesting. So there you guys go. That was my reaction. If you like this video, give it a like. Also, make sure to subscribe to my channel for more awesome Dragon Ball Super, Dragon Ball Z, and other anime things. And as always, I hope you all have a wonderful day. Stay fresh. Bye. <laughs>